come to the back of your mat into child's pose. Press your sit bones towards your heels, forehead and chest to the floor. Stretch your arms out in front of you and take three deep breaths. Inhale, press forward into Cobra. Press the shoulders away from the ears. Make sure the shoulders are stacked directly above the wrist. Chest and heart shine forward. Feel free to adjust yourself as needed. Take a glance over the left shoulder. Take a glance over the right shoulder. Pull the upper back muscles down towards the base of the spine to further open the chest. Tuck the toes. Press up and back into downward facing dog. Adjust the feet. Adjust the hands. Inhale the navel to the spine, sending the hips further into the ceiling. Press the shoulders away from the ears. Release the back of the neck, letting the head hang. Take five full breaths here. And when you're ready, slight bend in the knees. Walk the hands to the back of the mat. Inhale, slowly ragdoll all the way up, vertebrae by vertebrae. Once the shoulders and head come up, arms come up. Inhale onto the toes and walk to the top of the mat. Exhale, release the feet to the mat. Inhale, take hold of the left wrist in the right hand and exhale over to the right side for a left side body stretch. Breathe into the left rib cage, the obliques, and inhale. Swap wrists, take hold of the right wrist with the left hand. Inhale and exhale over to the left side for a right side body stretch. Breathe into the lats, breathe into the obliques, Inhale up, interlace the fingers, press up, inhale, sending the chest up and back towards the ceiling, gaze towards the ceiling, and breathe. When you're ready on your next exhale, come forward, round throughout the back, tuck the chin to the chest, and breathe. Inhale up. Exhale the arms down by your side for mountain pose. Check your posture. Press down through all four corners of the feet. Shoulders down away from the ears. Inhale the arms up into the ceiling. Reach through the arms. Tuck the lower ribs towards the floor. And exhale, swan dive, fold forward. Release the back of the neck. Slight bend in the knees. Inhale, half lift. Flat back heart shining forward. Exhale, step back into high plank, release the knees, lower down for half plank. Inhale up for cobra. Adjust yourself. Again, look over the right shoulder, look over the left shoulder, shoulders away from the ears. Take a few breaths here. And when you're ready, Tuck the toes, press up and back into downward facing dog. Adjust the feet, adjust the hands. Inhale the navel to the spine. Release the back of the neck, letting the head hang. Feel free to pedal through the feet. Press the shoulders away from the ears. Take five full breaths here. And when you're ready, Inhale, bend the knees, look towards the top of the mat. Step or hop towards the top of the mat. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, forward fold. And inhale, ragdoll all the way up. Once the head comes up, arms come up. Exhale, the arms down for mountain pose. Inhale, the right knee up to the chest, arms come up. Exhale the hands to heart center and inhale. Exhale, open the right knee out to the right side and close. Exhale, press back into warrior three. 
Extend the right leg out back behind you, lowering the chest, leveling out the hips. Inhale, bring the right knee back to the chest. Exhale, step down, step it out. Let's set up for the left side. Inhale the left knee to the chest. Catch a balance. And exhale, open the left knee to the left side. Inhale it close. Exhale, press back into warrior three. Catch your balance. Press firm through that grounding foot as best as you can. Inhale the knee forward. Exhale the foot down. Step it out. Come to mountain pose. Check your posture here. Make sure you're grounded down through all four corners of the feet, engaging the inner thighs, shoulders down and back away from the ears. Inhale the arms up and exhale into chair pose. Breathe here. Exhale, take four folds. Inhale to half lift, flat back. And exhale, release the hands to the mat. Take a moment and step back into high plank. Excuse me while I get adjusted. Release the knees to the floor. Exhale the chest down. Inhale for Cobra. When you're ready, tuck the toes. Press the hips up and back into downward facing dog. Adjust the hands, adjust the feet. Slight bend in the knees. Release the neck, taking the gaze through the legs. Take the right knee forward through the arms. Release the left heel to the floor. And inhale the chest up for warrior one. The right knee is stacked above the right ankle. The back left leg is out straight. The hips are pointing forward. There's a 45 degree angle in the back left foot. Excuse me while I adjust my stance a little bit more. Windmill the arms back for reverse warrior. And exhale down into triangle pose. This is a variation of triangle pose with my right knee still bent and right elbow resting on my thigh to offer support. Breathe here, stretching through the left side body. Windmill the arms back to warrior one. Exhale, releasing the hands to the mat. Step back into high plank. Release the knees. Low plank. Inhale for cobra. And when you're ready, tuck the toes. Send the hips up and back into downward facing dog. Adjust the hands and the feet. Take five breaths here. Step it out through your downward dog. And when you're ready, step forward on the left side. Bring the left knee through the arms. Inhale the chest. For warrior one on the left side, left knee is stacked above the left ankle, right leg straight back behind you with the right foot at a 45 degree angle. Exhale, windmill the arms back into reverse warrior. And when you're ready, exhale, windmill the hands forward for a triangle pose on the left side with an assist. Stretching out of the right side body, breathing into the right lats, the right obliques. And when you're ready, cartwheel the arms back into warrior one. Release the arms back to the mat. Step back into high plank. Release the knees, lower the chest for low plank. Inhale to cobra. When you're ready, tuck the toes, press the hips up and back into downward facing dog. Press your shoulders away from your ears, adjust your hands, adjust your feet. Feel free to pedal through your downward dog here. When you're ready, look towards the top of the mat, step or hop to the top of the mat. Inhale for half lift, 
Exhale, forward fold. And inhale for chair pose. And exhale, press all the way up. Release the arms down to your side. Again, take chair pose. And exhale, forward fold. Inhale, half lift, flat back. Exhale, release, step back into high plank, release the knees, lower the chest, low plank. Inhale for Cobra. Adjust yourself. And when you're ready, tuck the toes, send the hips up and back into downward facing dog. Feel free to adjust your hands, adjust your feet. Inhale the navel to the spine, drawing the hips further up into the ceiling. Pedal through your downward dog, massaging out the hamstrings. Press firm through the shoulders, pressing the ears away from the shoulders. Inhale the right leg into the air towards the ceiling. Exhale, bring it towards the chest, placing the foot down through the hands. And inhale the chest for warrior one. Take several breaths here. Remember the right knee is stacked above the right ankle. The left leg is back behind you out straight. Hips point forward. There's about a 45 degree angle in that back left foot. Stretch through the arms. Stretch through the fingers. And when you're ready, release the arms back down to the mat. Step back into high plank, release the knees, lower into low plank. Inhale, press up into cobra. Adjust yourself. Shoulders away from the ears. And when you're ready, tuck the toes, send the hips up and back for downward facing dog. Adjust your hands, adjust your feet. Inhale the left leg towards the ceiling. Exhale, bring the left leg forward to the chest through the hands. Inhale, up for warrior one on the left side. Again, left knee is stacked above the left ankle. Right leg is back behind you. Right foot is almost at a 45 degree angle. Engage the hips, engage the core. Exhale, release the hands back to the mat. Step back into high plank, lower the knees, release the chest, press up into cobra. When you're ready, tuck your toes, send your hips up and back towards the ceiling for downward facing dog. Adjust your hands, adjust your feet, pedal through your downward dog. Press your shoulders away from the ears. Inhale the right leg towards the ceiling. Open the right knee to the right side of the room. Release the foot down to the mat for wildling. Inhale, press back up into downward facing dog. Inhale the left leg towards the ceiling. Open the left leg to the left side of the room. Release the left leg down and press up into wildling. Inhale, press back up into three-legged dog, back down into downward facing dog. Inhale, look towards the top of the mat, step or hop to the top of your mat. Gather yourself. And when you're ready, inhale, half lift, flat back, exhale, forward fold. Inhale, half lift, flat back, exhale, forward fold. Inhale to chair pose. And exhale, press all the way up. And release the arms back down into standing. Take several breaths here. Inhale the hands to heart center. Give thanks to your body for all of its capabilities and all of its possibilities. Practice always and remember all is coming. Namaste. Come to a comfortable and seated position. The spine is tall and the core is engaged and strong. 
The hands rest gently on the knees or thighs. Eyes are closed and the face is relaxed from the space between your eyebrows all the way through the jaw. The teeth are unclenched and the lips are slightly parted. As you sit here, allow the mind to rest as you breathe in through the nose and out through the mouth. As the mind rests, begin to silence your own thoughts and focus solely on my words. Breathe in through the nose and out through the mouth, allowing yourself to relax more and more with each breath. Breathing in and breathing out. Breathing in and breathing out. Over the past few years, we have all been seeing so much information that does not support the idea of black worth in America. This can often cause us to hold tension in our bodies unknowingly just because we don't know when the next moment is going to come that we face yet another death or another display of this untruth that black life is not worthy life. When you're constantly holding your breath, feeling suffocated in a world shaped to quell the majesty that we possess, the body naturally tenses up. And for a while, that has been our posture, stuck at the top of an inhale. But today, I want to encourage us to exhale and feel the relief of relaxation that overtakes our bodies as we do. With each breath that we take together, I want to remind us that we are worthy. We are worthy of everything that we deem good, and we're worthy of a moment to relax. And so right now, I want us to take time to do that. With the knowledge that no matter where we are, no matter what is going on around us, we have access to this breath to this release of pressure and this feeling of relaxation. And so we breathe. Deep breath in for four, three, two, one. Hold it at the top. Take in a little more air and slowly exhale for four, three, two, one. Inhale for four, three, two, one, hold. Slowly exhale, four, three, two, one. This time seamlessly breathe in for four, three, two, one. Exhale, four, three, two, one. One, inhale, four, three, two, one, exhale, four, three, two, one. Last time, inhale, four, three, two, one, exhale, four, three, two, one. Return to the natural rhythm of your own breath keeping the face and body relaxed, slowly bringing the lips together gently and inhaling through the nose and exhaling through the nose. Always remembering that you have access to this space no matter where you are 
and no matter what's going on around you. You have and so rightfully deserve the privilege to breathe and to be.